How's it going, guys? We're doing amazing over here. Hope you guys are doing good as well. Uh, all right, guys, Link. I know I don't cover this a lot on the channel. I wish I could cover more of these, guys. I just don't have time to cover all videos for all of our coins. But I want you guys to know, come over here. You guys do need your subscription over here. It's $49 a month. Go to the live trades and scroll down. Click any of these. Click Bitcoin, uh, Ethereum, Dogecoin, Cardano, Ripple, Uniswap, VeChain, Polygon. Um, come over here and click Link, Polkadot. All of these are live trades you guys can take right now, and this is what we are doing on the channel. This is how I've been able to make um, about $850 in the last two to three weeks, as well as all of my entries for Ethereum and ADA are set up. And then I also have in the withdrawals you guys have seen here time after time of how I've been doing in the market. We haven't lost a trade yet on this channel. We've been doing very well. Let me change this really quick here. So I wanted to start this video with that to give you guys a little credibility uh, of how we're doing. All right. So everybody who has their subscription over at Trade Confident entered into this website. Your first buy limit was at $24.48. I'm going to show this to you guys. I normally don't do this because I want to keep this private for our members, but I'll show you the exact call that was up here so I can show you guys this is transparent. This was the call. The first buy limit was set down here at $24.48. Here is how you trade this. Like any of the coins you guys just saw me go over, there are live trades right now you can take that look exactly like this. The white line is the price structure. The orange lines are your buy limits. You look for the first four yellow lines below the current price, and these are your four buy limits. You have $1,000, $250 here, 250 here, 250 here, 250 here. Where do you put it in? The price is right here. This cannot get any more simple, guys. That is how you enter into this market with dollar cost average entries, and this is very good risk management. Where is your sell limit? Well, put your sell limit at wherever the closest yellow bar is on the uh, the chart for this is going to be a link. Make sure you guys watch it this morning because this will be updating just hint, hint of where that sell limit's going to be. Okay. So this is what our traders are doing. Everyone who's been following this on link, you guys got in here at 2448 and you guys are currently up 9.64%. I am going to be calling a trade exit on this in this video. So, so follow me here. I want you guys to pay attention down here to the trend exhaustion and the price versus the well money flow real quick. Now, when we get down into the bottom section of this trend exhaustion, the bottom red, we usually start seeing a price move back up. This was correlated very well to our entry here, and that is why I believe we ended up seeing a move up. One of the reasons, okay? Take a look at this. We ended up seeing a move back up. Take a look at this over here. We ended up calling the bottom on the chart here, and we saw a move back up. Time after time, I can prove to you guys that this indicator is literally like I really do believe it's the best indicator in the market right now to call the tops and the bottoms for, for all of cryptocurrencies. I just did a, a video on VeChain where it called literally every jump in the last uh, 30 to 35 days. Every single jump it called, and I'm showing this to you guys here as well. When the trend starts moving down and gets to the bottom red zone, Hello guys, that is a time where you want to look to buy. I am using this indicator to also set all the buy limits for us over on the exchanges for you guys when you're looking over here on the website. That is how I was ended up, ended up able to set this. It's why I ended up setting the other levels where they're at. So. What I'm looking for is to use this indicator to look to scale out as well. Now, since you're up right now about 9.64%, this is where I would be calling an official exit of at least 25% of what you guys are trading in here. So right here, I am calling an exit at $26.57 of 25% of your trade. I am not a financial advisor. I'm just saying this. I would take out 25% right now, let the rest of the 75% ride. Now, let me call the next exit for you guys because I'm not going to cover this for probably another... I'm probably not going to cover this until next week because I, I'm trying to cover all these other big majors over here. But watch this indicator. Get it on your charts, guys. Literally 24 hours, the prices are going up. Just snag this. When it gets to the top red zone up here, that is where I would be looking to sell at least another 25 to 50%. I would be looking to sell 50%. If you guys don't believe me that I'm, I'm, I'm honest about this stuff, I'm doing the exact same thing over here with ADA. I entered into the trade, I ended up exiting 25%. The next time I get up into the top red section, I'm gonna exit 50 to 25%. I'm doing exactly everything I'm telling you guys to do. So I'm not just saying do this and I don't have like skin in the game. like. I'm working with $10,000 here. I am doing exactly what I'm telling you guys. So it's really fun for all of us to be here together. Kind of what I'm trying to say here. So I am calling an official exit of 25% right now. Congratulations, guys. Up 8.62% on your first 25% in your market. Okay, let's come up here. I wanna look at the metrics with you guys real quick on a uh, link because I wanna show you guys something that I really like. This is such a good time right now, guys. I know I'm a broken record. I was the, I was the, 
I wasn't the most hated, obviously, but I was I was getting a lot of hate comments saying, guys, don't buy this move up. Don't buy this move up. And we we're looking for a move back down. We are starting to see this correction happen in the market, but I am getting so much, I'm getting very bullish on these videos, guys, if you have not noticed, because I'm following the metrics. We have never pushed down into the anxious or the fearful section on a link, and not just link, the other coins as well, without seeing a move back up in the market. We have seen a pump up every single time we've gotten down into the bottom section here where the market has been anxious or fearful. Like, just look, like there it is. There's all of your proof every time. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Are we on the eighth time here where we have a low, a high, a higher low looking to form a higher high? This is why you guys need to be following us over here because I do believe we have some of the best metrics to call these moves up. 8 a.m. Pacific Standard Time, the metrics update every single day. You guys do need your membership at $49 a month to access this. Super cheap for what you guys get, I promise. Okay, long versus short trades. This is another bullish sign that we could see Link start heading up here. We are seeing price structure move out of the market, but long trades are moving up. This is a positive sign for the price to possibly move back up here because st structure moving down with money flowing into the market, y it usually cannot help itself from moving back up. Don't believe me? Let me prove it to you. See this over here where we start seeing price structure move out of the market? Comes straight down. What's happening with long trades? Long trades are increasing. What happened right after that? We hit our all-time high, okay? Look into the past to see what has happened before. And if you guys can understand how that works, you, you can... It helps you guys call call pumps and drops in the market, okay? Even price structure moving down right here while long trades are moving up, market ends up moving up again. You cannot see price structure move down and keep moving down while long trades are into the market without seeing a pump back up, okay? That's why you guys wanna be coming over here and accessing these metrics. Now, is it a good time to take short trades? In my opinion, absolutely not. We are not in the good trade area. This is assessing the risk of your trade this morning. So if you guys are like, should I take a long trade or should I take a short trade? Well, honestly, you guys should have already been over here and in a long trade. If you're brand new to this channel, make sure you subscribe because I'm, we're doing live videos every day. I understand that you're not in here, but what you guys can do is set up your trade at the buy limits that I have here that are gonna be updated at 8 a.m. Pacific Standard Time. Most likely the buy limits are gonna stay where they're at, but make sure you guys are set up over here because this is how we're trading the market. My point being is that this is pushing down into the good long trade section with this blue metric line. This is the low, the high, possibly a higher low to form a higher high formation in the market. Very bullish on the charts right now. Now, let me just pause here for one second. For Bitcoin, and I'll come out with a Bitcoin video tomorrow, Bitcoin still could have a big correction. Ethereum, I have been calling that Ethereum could move down to 2,500. Now, although coins could be heading down, the point of me calling a move down in those is to even give more reference to you need to have your long trades set up. That is why I am bullish. If the market moves down, this channel, at least, is gonna be buying like crazy. So, just wanna make that clear. Well and institutional smart money for Link. It is clearly on the long trade side. Guys, like follow this. There are retail traders right now who are freaking out and they're in the anxious and the fearful section. How do I know that? I'll prove it to you because everybody FOMO'd into the top up here and they FOMO'd into these top positions and they're losing money in the market right now, okay? They're, they still have, nobody who entered in up here has recouped their losses yet. They're still holding. And if it drops even further, we could be selling, seeing all of the buyers who bought up here starting to sell because they think it's gonna go even lower if we break support here. So we could start seeing more sell pressure into the market. That is another reason why I'm telling you guys you need to set up your long trades because when people are anxious, smart money, institutions, and wells, they are buying the fear and the anxiety of retail traders and they are going to make their money in the market. Hence exactly what we did and what you guys ended up doing and why you're up over probably 9% at the moment, about 8 point, sorry, 8.99 almost exactly at nine. Let's keep moving down here. Hopefully you guys are able to understand this as I'm going through these videos and you're like, okay, I see what he's saying. I understand the value of this. Take a look at this real quick and then we're gonna go back over the chart and we'll end this video. But if you take a look at the support and resistance prices, the next place where I do think we could head if we move back down is 23.9, very close to $24. 23.9 puts us right at this structured low here, okay? Now, obviously I wanna look at where we could head up to and stall. That is going to be right up here at $29.31 also very close to the psychological level of 30 
dollars. Structure high up here at around $30 is where I do believe this move could head. Now, pay attention guys, this trend exhaustion is not up into the top here yet. When we do get up into the top sections here, this is when I do expect to see the market drop back down and see moves down. It's very clear that historically when we've been up into this top red section, that is where we see the market move back down. Okay, I, like, I'll just pull a couple more here to just to prove this to you guys. Literally, this called the top here before we move back down here, and I'll just pull this other one real quick. It's literally right at the top. You guys follow me? Like, top red section. There, 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 there. Okay, I don't know if this helps if I do it like this, that you guys can correlate this a little bit better. But this is where I'm telling you guys, this indicator is ridiculous. So the next exit, I'll finish up, actually, let me finish, I know this is looking crazy, but that's, that's basically where I'm looking for an exit there. And then basically we have the entries here for those of you guys who entered in here, you're holding the position. And then those of you who entered in here, you know, these are all the exit points, guys. This is calling the exit here that ended up dropping us in the market. We bought in and we wrote it back up, okay. I want to make sure, I want to keep these drawings on here to show this to you guys. The next time we move up into the top red section, that is a place where I would highly suggest you guys look to take 25%. So let me end this video by saying this. First of all, the indicators are going up in 24 hours. Make sure you guys get this. The bundle package in the description and on our website is the best deal flat out, like stupid ridiculous. It's it's $399 and our indicator is like $1,600 if you want all of them. So it's crazy. I also want you guys to look to exit 25% right now, not financial advice. And then next time you see the trend exhaustion push in the top red section up here, that is where I would highly recommend, not financial advice, you guys take 25 to 50% out of the market because that has shown us historically we are seeing drops. And these aren't small, tiny little drops in the market, guys. Like These are big moves. Some of these are over 20% drops in the market here. Um, if you guys come up here and pull this price range, these are very big drops in the market. We're looking at about 19.67, about 20% drop on that. So pay attention to this. Get these indicators on your chart. Make sure you guys do have your long trade set up. All it requires is a membership and you guys can actually come over and set up trades for all of these coins at the moment. I personally suggest coming into Ethereum. That's where I'm set up. I personally also suggest looking deeply into Cardano as well as Dogecoin right now for entering into trades because I believe those could be popping very soon as well as VET. Okay, give you guys my top coins here. God bless you guys so, so much. Everything you need is in the description to acquire all of the indicators and the metrics. And let me know if you guys have any questions. Email me at btradeconfident at gmail.com. God bless you guys, and I'll see you next video. Congrats, guys. Bye-bye.